Doing good, doing good. On my way to work. Okay, well, Brian, you knew the rarest of all comic books. And if you have one, it's worth $5.3 million. Which one is it? The very first Superman. That's right, Superman 1. And uh, they're, for some reason, they're just not around for some reason. But if you have one, uh, go ahead and check out. It's like winning the lottery. So, Brian. Yeah. C- c- I wish I had one. <laughs> yeah, I wish I did too. But uh, my ex morning show partner, Clint McElroy, stole everyone I had. But anyway, Brian, oh. hey, congratulations. Here's what you won. Yeah, Brian, it's not the first episode of Superman, but it's still a pretty good prize package. You've won yourself a full course meal from Penn Station East Coast Subs on the north end of Chillicothe Street in Portsmouth where they pride themselves on being all about the freshness. That will provide you with the sandwich, wrap, or salad of your choice, a soft drink, and those fantastic fresh-cut fries. And, Brian, don't forget that today, like every Tuesday, is free chocolate chip cookie day. Congratulations. Right. Congratulations. And, Brian, stay super, man. All right. Will do. Have a good one. You guys soon. Bye-bye. You too. All right. Bye. Good guy. Brian Benner. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, I, I know you're going to go home and immediately start looking through and see if you have a copy. No, I, I know I don't because no. my dad threw all my comic books and baseball cards out many years ago. He knew that if you had too much money as an adult, that would be a bad thing. Yes, the ill-gotten <laughs> gains of a misspent youth. <laughs> <laughs> Time for news brought to you by Ricer Equipment, U.S. 23 North between Lucasville and Piketon and off 32 in Jackson, your home of Kubota. Once again, Bill Show. Thanks, Steve. Good morning, everyone. Republican State Senator Tim Schaefer of Ohio announced the Ohio State House School Bus Transportation Grant Program. It's open September 23rd through September 30th. The grant helps schools cover the cost of bus transportation for field trips to our state capitol. Now, grants will be awarded by the Capitol Square Review and Advisory Board and the Capitol Square Foundation in partnership with Honda of America Manufacturing. Any Ohio school that receives state funding can apply Grants are limited to 4th through 12th grade students during the, this school year. A random lottery selection will be utilized to choose a number of schools from each category, which is determined by mileage from the State House. Meanwhile, you can turn your eyes to the sky tonight for an extra special full moon. It's the harvest moon, or closest full moon to the autumnal equinox. It's also going to be a super moon. It'll appear larger and brighter in tonight's sky. Now, if that's not enough... There's also going to be a partial lunar eclipse. The full moon and lunar eclipse will take place tonight, well into Wednesday morning. The lunar eclipse will begin when the moon enters the Earth's partial shadow at 841, but it'll be difficult to notice until the top edge of the moon begins entering the full shadow just after 10 o'clock. The eclipse peak will occur at 1044, with 8% of the moon in the Earth's full shadow. It's going to make it look like a big bite has been taken out of the moon. For Mix 99.3 News, I'm Bill Shope. All right, thank you, Bill. And this update brought to you this morning by Ricer Equipment, U.S. 23 North, between Lucasville and Piketon, and off 32 in Jackson, your home of Kubota. When you cut lawns for a living, reliability matters. The Kubota commercial lineup with purpose-built mowers like the Z700 Zero Turn, SZ Stand-On, and the W-Series Walk Behind. Decrease downtime and increase productivity. A comprehensive fleet program with special discounts and free loaners helps grow your business. One per Perfectly manicured lawn at a time. Visit Ricer Equipment north of Lucasville, U.S. 23, or in Jackson at Burlington Road, just off 32. Visit online at RicerEquipment.com or on Facebook today. And good morning, 13 after. Time for sports brought to you by Barrett Murphy Insurance. 1031 Gallia Street, Dan Cassidy there. You're in Cova Agent. And once again, here's Chuck. Thanks, Steve. The Atlanta Falcons knocked off the Philadelphia Eagles 22-21 to last night in the Monday night football game played in the city of brotherly love. It looked like the Eagles were going to hold on for the win as they were up by six with a minute 39 left, but Atlanta got the ball, drove 70 yards down the field, scored a touchdown to tie it, an extra point to win it. Kirk Cousins threw for 241 yards and two touchdowns in guiding the Falcons to the victory. In other NFL news, the Carolina Panthers have announced they are going to bench quarterback Bryce Young and go with ex-Bengal Andy Dalton when the team plays the Raiders this coming weekend. In college football news, Texas is the new number one in this week's AP poll. Georgia has slipped to second after struggling to get a one-point victory at Kentucky this past weekend. That isn't the case, however, in this week's coaches poll. In those rankings, Georgia remains number one and Texas is second. Ohio State is third in both polls this week. The Reds were off last night. They'll host the Atlanta Braves this evening for a 641st pitch. You can hear that contest on Fox Sportsman AM 1260 and 95. 
93.7 FM. Coverage will begin at 610. Brandon Williamson will get the start this evening for Cincy. Atlanta will counter with Grant Holmes. And the Guardians topped the Twins 4-3 to yesterday. Cleveland rallied from 3 down to get the victory. The Guardians will host Minnesota again this evening at 640. Cleveland currently has a five-game lead in the AL Central. Your Portsmouth Insurance Sports Time is a quarter past 8. Portsmouth Insurance is a TAH Benefits partner. Call Gary Duzan for all of your employee benefit needs. And that is a look at sports. All right. Thank you, Chuck. And brought to you this morning by Barrett Murphy Insurance, 1031 Gallia Street. Again, your uh, insurance agency, uh, Dan Cassidy, there for anything you need in home, car, business. He's the man. And we got traffic weather coming up. At the Barrett Murphy Insurance Agency, they're proud to cheer for the home team and even more proud to have you on their team. Whether you need insurance for your home, car, or business, they have your back. And because the local community is so important to them, they'll be right there with you, cheering for your team. Contact the Barrett Murphy Insurance Agency today for more information about a policy from Encova Insurance. Visit the Barrett Murphy Insurance Agency at 1031 Gallia Street in Portsmouth, online at barrettmurphy.com. And your traffic and service of your good friends at the Side River, 1024 Gallagher Street. And, of course, the river will be there with legendary steaks, chicken, ribs, and more where the doors open this morning at 11. Got a little rain coming down this morning, we do, but uh, not a lot at this point, but it's kind of light. Uh, with that, don't forget Ohio River Road in Porter Township will be maintained today with the use of flaggers, one lane there. Pond Run closed for 90 days at the .46 mile marker, which is crazy because those four people can't get to the highway. They have to go all the way through the forest to get out of there. And uh, we've got the Shelley Company also paving this coming Friday. One lane maintained with the use of flaggers. That'll be Bull Run Road, Deaver Road, Luther Road, and Madison Township. And if you see something we need to know about, give us a call, 354-1993. Traffic and service of your friends at the Scioto River opens seven days a week. Weather and service of A1 Auto Glass, which now has a windshield calibration machine used to recalibrate all of the safety features in the windshields of foreign vehicles. This used to have to be done at a dealership after installation, but now you can save money by getting it done at A1 Auto Glass in Portsmouth. First alert forecast from WSAZ. Generally cloudy today with occasional showers making it in. Temperatures reaching the lower 80s in the afternoon. Mostly cloudy with another scattered shower overnight tonight. Lows in the lower 60s. Partly sunny at times on Wednesday. Still a lingering shower. We'll take what we can get. Highs in the low 80s. I'm WSAZ News Channel 3 meteorologist Brandon Butcher on the Ohio Valley's hit music channel. Mix 99.3. And downtown right now cloudy skies. Some scattered showers. We got 62 as we get up and go. The best music variety and most fun in the morning. It's Steve Hayes and the Get Up and Go Show on WNXT AM FM Portsmouth and on WNXTRadio.com. Mix 99.3.